Thank you for clicking Dr. Samurai Minute Lecture. In this video, I would like to answer the question of why there are so many sequences of TV dramas and movies today, and also why there are so many businesses which uh, so clearly uh, aim to hit the jackpot in today's society. My name is Dr. Samurai. I'm a professor specialized in international social pathology. Lately, living in a uh, metropolitan city, Tokyo, I have this uh, strong impression that uh, there are so many businesses that uh, are intentionally and so clearly trying to uh, hit the jackpot. That means uh, their interest is not in uh, producing uh, good products, but uh, their motive is just to uh, obtain the uh, most profit, ignoring the quality of their products or business services. What I mean by that is, uh, say, uh, this uh, ramen noodle shop. It used to be that there was this uh, one ramen noodle shop in my neighborhood. True story. This uh, old gentleman from uh, Tohoku area, which uh, you may know had that uh, big earthquake, he had this uh, very small joint of uh, holding only uh, eight customers or so at one time. He never talks to uh, customers, quietly uh, proceed in his routine, and he opened the shop only uh, three hours around noon. Because of that, uh, there was a line of customers waiting outside because the joint is too small for them to be waiting inside. But anyway, why the ramen noodle shop was so popular was to, that gentleman was trying to uh, maintain the taste of ramen noodle which he used to uh, eat during his uh, childhood in his uh, local area. So uh, it took him a long time to prepare, like he wakes up five o'clock in the morning just to prepare everyday business, which opens only for three hours around noon. The preparation was uh, way more elaborate than the other ramen noodle shop. And the price was only uh, $8 or so, but the taste of the ramen noodle that he cooks was uh, so unspeakably uh, deep and uh, intricate with the deep flavors of uh, different kinds of fish stock. I still remember each time I was so excited to uh, put my uh, spoon into the soup and uh, carrying it into my mouth. I never touched uh, noodles for the first uh, couple of minutes. I just uh, continuously uh, tasted the broth of the ramen noodles. However, he uh, became older and uh, he uh, could not maintain the quality of the ramen noodle that he has been uh, managing to uh, maintain. So he closed the shop. After that, all the ramen noodle shops that I see on TV, which they say serve uh, great quality ramen noodles. I tried them all, but uh, never was the same level as that gentleman's uh, simple but deep local taste. Why? Because most of the newer ramen noodle shop, they do not have such spiritual goal as that uh, gentleman had. He wanted to maintain the taste that he used to taste when he was a little kid in his uh, rural town. But uh, new ramen noodle shops are not like that. They uh, deliberately uh, accentuate certain taste that could uh, attract more customers. So all the, the tastes are very shallow, only with the accentuation of uh, what could uh, impress the customers 
as uh, emphasizing uh, certain uh, popular features. Everything is so intentional and deliberate just to uh, lure more customers with their superficial strong tastes and flavors. Uh, if you like this kind of deep discussions, please click that uh, green and yellow good luck charm logo. And the same trend can be seen in the sequences of uh, popular TV dramas and movies. As you may uh, very well know it, today it is like uh, the more sequences the drama has, the better and more popular they are, and so on. But uh, what sits deep down in that trend is just to make profits. As the first series was successful, then the producer uh, thinks he can expect uh, pretty much the same level of success in the second series, and third, and fourth, and on and on. Though the first sequence may have genuine theme that uh, producers may want to advocate to the audience, after a second sequence on, that genuine spirit seen in the first sequence is uh, continuously diluting in the second sequence on, because their theme becomes more into uh, making profit, not making uh, points socially. And uh, what I would like to uh, point out is this. If you uh, are feeling today's entertainment and also uh, taste of today's uh, franchised uh, business or uh, not as attractive as uh, they used to be, it is because they are not after the genuine interest in uh, making people feel and think their deep meaning or deep taste of it. They are making it to make more profit. That is why everything is so superficial, with the, mostly with the deliberate and intentional accentuation of certain uh, features or tastes or flavors. And that is why most of what we see on TV and uh, movies and most of what we uh, taste at today's restaurants are seem to be cheap and uh, shallow. And many times going back to what were popular in old days, just to uh, pick the themes and taste which were one time popular just to make sure what they make will be as successful. They are just dried out of uh, new and original topic or taste that comes from their genuine and authentic passion for making it. I would uh, really like to know what you think about this point that I'm making here. And if you are interested in this kind of discussions, please click that the red Dr. Summer logo. Wherever you are, my friend, on this same very small planet Earth during this very short period of time. Okay, thank you. Bye-bye now.